My name is Gert Rausch. I'm the executive chef at the Aqua Grill in Sandwich, Massachusetts. Today we're going to uh, cook a bouillabaisse, which is one of France's national dishes. The most important thing in a bouillabaisse is the fennel. And um, lots of garlic, a little bit of olive oil, some jicama, some carrots, a little bit of saffron, and lots of butter and some white wine. Obviously, I told you about the vegetables, now I'm telling you about the seafood. Since we are living on Cape Cod, we are using lobster, uh, little necks, uh, mussels, some nice big shrimp, and some plump scallops. Uh, you can do any kind, you can do the bouillabaisse with any kind of different seafood. It doesn't have to be any of the seafood. If you live in a different region, try to buy the freshest and the best seafood you can find. All right, so what we're going to do right now is we're going to start the bouillabaisse. And I'm going to use two different parts here. And one of them is for the seafood and one is for the vegetable. Because we want to keep the vegetable nice and crisp. Uh, I'm going to add some, uh, some freshly sliced uh, garlic in my other frying pan, which I added just a little bit of olive oil. I'm going to add my seafood. I'm going to add first the little necks because they take a lot of time to open up. I'm going to add my mussels. And my shrimp. and my scallops and I'm going to saute them lightly <coughs> now I'm going to add my sauteed <coughs> garlic You see, and now I'm going to add my fennel. So we can leave this hole, the lobster, or we can take it out of the claws out of the shells. But what we're going to do is we're going to leave it in there like this. It looks much nicer. It's a little bit messy to eat, but people at least definitely know that it's fresh lobster. Uh, and what we're going to do right now is I'm taking all the roe and put it into the stock because the roe gives that really beautiful lobster taste. It's actually the most uh, tasting part. In Europe they make, uh, out of the roast, that's where they make butters out of it and they add it to uh, like uh, grilled fish or uh, like to ravioli, so things like this, or lobster bisques. Then we're going to add the lobster claws to it and the lobster tails. You let it simmer for a little bit longer. And then you add the fine chopped jicama and carrots to it. And then to make, the, make it very flavorful, let's put a, at least two teaspoons of butter. Because the butter uh, makes the sauce nice and glazy looking and it gives it a beautiful texture. And that's it. So this is our finished Booyah base and here you see our ingredients, our mussels, 
our little necks, our shrimp, the scallops, the lobster, our fennel, and look at the beautiful yellow broth which was made and out of the saffron. Uh, this is Gert, the executive chef at Aqua Grill in Sandwich, Massachusetts, and we are looking forward to seeing you.